Hey everybody, it's Prophetic here. It's been a while since the video. Uh, I've been kind of super busy, super crazy, but everyone says that, right? Um, I've just been um, really falling more and more in love with MX. Um, and I just want to kind of give you a rundown of some of the reasons why. Um, as you guys know, MX comes default with XFCE and uh, has a very, um, I guess, a different take on like what a default should look like. Um, thankfully, as just with any Linux distribution, you can customize things and tweak it. And uh, what I did for me was uh, install Plasma. Uh, now, my machine, um, it's uh, Plasma 5.8. It's kind of dated, um, but that's because of the Debian base. And um, I just, you know, I tweak my Plasma environment pretty often uh, for now I have a pretty much basic panel on the bottom with the launcher full screen launcher similar to unity right here um, and um, so again going back to the reasons why I really appreciate uh, MX is all the great tools it has here for um, installing packages let me just pass the password in. So desktop environments, right? Um, I have Plasma installed. Um, I don't know why it's not reading that it's already installed. Oh yes, okay, yeah, I see uninstall. I see install here, I see here. That's weird, it's interesting. Um, Budgie, GNOME, Mate, so anything you have, you really can get here in terms of desktop environment. So while people think like, oh, I don't like the desktop environment, well, you can do some, you got some options here. Um, stable repos, testing, back ports and flat packs. Um, I just got snaps working. Um, I had some, had to tweak some, something with a temp file um, and setting certain permissions for that. But got that working, and um, yeah. So if you if you want a stable, super stable base, um, Debian is a obvious obviously a great choice. Um, but if you want newer software, you got testing, you got backports, you got flat packs, and then with some tweaking if you have to. Again, I guess some people have different um, experiences. My snaps had issues. Um, I had to tweak it a little bit. Other people just do the grub installer actually let's walk through that let's go through that grab a customizer I should say and what I did was made the system D uh, the default and I can actually uh, move it up some more too so it's usually the first one that gets selected But that's some of the things that is super powerful with MX. Um, you can tweak things um, as you want. So don't think that just because it's a Debian, a Debian uh, stable release, that everything has to be old. Not necessarily. Um, you can do a lot of different things with it and you have your options and um the only thing that i miss from neon when i was on my neon system was vaults and what i did with that is use veracrypt veracrypt is a kind of think of it as a vault like system um and um boom i'm happy super happy no issues i had one issue with a login issue where I couldn't log back in after being um, on a sleep mode or timed out to the login manager. And I, th I don't know what it was. I was running Audacity. I was running something else. And um, it was the middle of a meeting. And uh, I got kind of locked out a little bit. But again, even the black screen that says that, hey, something's not working right, try this. I was able to get right back in and 
reset something and I was back in it. And that's like really the only issue I've had with MX. Um, I can't think of anything else that's happened. It just worked. Everything just works. I My apps don't crash. I haven't had any issues with apps. Um, and Plasma, um, I didn't have Plasma hang up on me and freeze. I haven't had anything laggy. Like everything has been just super fast. I my, my brother-in-law who is a uh, works in IT for the governor's office. Uh, I don't want to say which governor and which state. Um, but he was just super surprised that my machine would render these things so fast. So even when I do like bookmarks, documents, it would just come up. Um, yeah, things would just come up so fast. He was impressed by how fast everything was. And, um, you know, of course, you have your wonderful screen switcher um, gnome like experience love that love 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 that and um, I think the animations slow down just a bit so it has even more of a gnome feel I didn't like how it was a little too fast um, like the little glide effect it has and uh, I have a little notif uh, notifications thing on the top right uh, until I hide here it's because I like sometimes I have multiple windows and like you using all the real estate in the bottom here I'm not crazy about icon task managers on the bottom panel um, I like seeing the text of what it's actually running um, I forgot what I have it set to if I have two yeah see I can I just maybe I'm just too old school but I kind of like just having that different naming I know exactly where I go to I don't have to hover and then select even though that's nice too sometimes hovering and selecting the two different windows I just like having all separated out um, so again so you got MX is tweakable throw in plasma in there super tweakable I mean look you got dolphin as a file manager come on um, how can you not win with this how can you not win with MX um, it's it, and lastly I say the community is great uh, got some help on the middle telegram group dolphins always a champ the forums i've been on the forums um once or twice with conky i think that was issue that wasn't even an issue with mx it was really conky i suddenly had a tweak in conky um that's gone um and the community was great and helping problem solve and tweak it you know and everyone says oh what our best feature of our distro is the community like come on everybody says that that's not true um, I think with MX, it's true. You know, the community is great, very helpful. And um, how many, not too many projects can collaborate like NTX and, and, and Dolphin and the developers and all those guys to make MX. Like collaboration in Linux is always touch and go, you know. Um, to see it actually produce a product like this is pretty impressive. So that's my MX um, system. Some of the things, well, some of the reasons why I love it so much and uh, you should if you're on the fence you should definitely give it a try see you later